The coast is getting slammed with high winds and downpours, and that's hard on residents, businesses, and our camera gear, as you're about to see. KZI 9 News reporter Jennifer Richardson continues our team coverage in Florence. Hurricane force winds are being reported here on the coast, and there's a high surf advisory. It's really hard to walk around here without being blown around, and residents say it's just a sign that the winter season is here. Bridgeport market owner Jay Cable has lived and owned a business in Florence for years. We've seen a few storms come by. Yes, we have, and we're right here in the in the brunt of it. He says this storm really started to get its force this morning. We have the heavy gusts, and uh, that's what I've seen is some, some heavy gusts, the trees out front really bending and swaying. They're doing a construction project across the street, and I saw some of the, uh, the barricades tipping over. And he says, fortunately, most of the fishermen are done fishing. We found a number of residents hiding out in local restaurants and coffee shops, escaping the downpours. I could be outdoors today, but I'm not that desperate to do anything outdoors, so I'll take the day off from that. I live by the beach, too, and so my house does shake and rattle, but I mean, I don't know. It's not anything unusual. Still, the waves are churning, and some say they just can't miss checking out the surf. One visitor even brought his wind meter. We got a max of 40. I just came from New York and that's we just went through Hurricane Sandy. So what we're going through here is comparable, but it's kind of nice that we're out on the coast instead of in the city with all the dangerous trees. Still left and right, we saw residents running for cover or just slowing down with a good book. We just sort of hunker down and, and, and watch the storms and and uh, yeah, business gets kind of slow in the winter. Lane County Sheriff's Office is on alert monitoring the high winds and the possibility for flooding. Reporting from Florence, Jennifer Richardson, KZI 9 News.